Hello everyone. Welcome to learn to live. This video is based on the topic number of vibrational modes. In order to understand the position of an atom in a molecule, we require 3 degrees of freedom. This indicates that for a molecule with n number of atoms, there will be 3 into n degrees of freedom which is equal to 3n, where 3 represents the degrees of freedom per atom, and n represents the number of atoms in a molecule. Now, let us learn about the number of vibrational modes in linear molecules. For a linear molecule, there are 3 translational and 2 rotational degrees of freedom. Thus, number of vibrational modes in linear molecules is equal to 3n minus 5 where, the sum of, 3 translational, and 2 rotational degrees of freedom represents, 5. Example 1. Consider the linear molecule, HCl. In the HCl molecule, there are two atoms, hydrogen, and chlorine, which means, here the value of n is equal to 2, substituting this value in the equation, 3n minus 5. Number of vibrational modes in HCl molecule, becomes equal to, 3, into, 2, minus, 5, which is equal to, 1. This means, there will be only one vibrational mode in HCl molecule, which is, stretching vibration. The figure shows, the stretching vibration, in HCl molecule, for better understanding. Example 2. Consider CO2 molecule. There are three atoms in the CO2 molecule. Therefore, number of vibrational modes, in CO2 molecule, is equal to, 3, into, 3, minus, 5, which is equal to, 4. This means, there are 4 vibrational modes, in the CO2 molecule. The 4 vibrational modes are, symmetric stretching, asymmetric stretching, bending in plane, bending out of plane. The pictorial representation of these 4 vibrational modes are shown for better understanding. The first picture represents, symmetric stretching. In this vibrational mode, there is no change in dipole moment, so, it is IR inactive. The second picture represents, asymmetric stretching. In this vibrational mode, there is change in dipole moment, so, it is IR active. The third picture represents, bending in plane. In this vibrational mode, there is change in dipole moment, so, it is IR active. The fourth picture represents, bending out of plane. In this vibrational mode, there is change in dipole moment, so, it is also IR active. Now, let us learn about the number of vibrational modes, in non-linear molecules. For a non-linear molecule, there are three translational, and three rotational degrees of freedom. Therefore, the number of vibrational modes, in a non-linear molecule, is given by, 3n minus 6, where n represents the number of atoms in the molecule, and, the sum of three translational and three rotational degrees of freedom represents 6. For example, Consider the molecule, H2O. The H2O molecule has 3 atoms. Therefore, n, is equal to 3. Substituting this in the equation, 3n minus 6. Number of vibrational modes, in the H2O molecule, becomes equal to, 3, into, 3, minus 6. Which is equal to 3. Which means there are 3 vibrational modes, for H2O molecule. The 3 vibrational modes in H2O molecule are, Asymmetric stretching, symmetric stretching, and, bending in plane. The pictorial representation of these three modes of vibration, are shown for better understanding. This is the end of this video. Please like and subscribe if you like the content. Press the bell icon to get instant notification.